welcome to our Walk on Wall Street. Uh, quick update for you. Um, as US stocks open, the SP 500 opened up uh, 59 spot, 47 points higher, or 2.08% at 2922 spot 86. Uh, that's the flash from Reuters. Um, but of course, uh, where we're trading now, uh, we've seen it open up higher. Uh, just ahead of the open, um, the cash market here, which uh, continues to trade, obviously out of out of hours with the, based on the futures, um, that popped up and tested this key level here, our uh, 61.8 percent retracement off the drawdown to the trough in the middle of March. So that 61.8 percent retracement, this line here, providing near-term resistance uh, support coming in. Big level at 28.85, yesterday's close at 28.63. Um, all down to um, news from Gilead, which um, has suggested that it's getting some good results from drug trials uh, from its remdesivir uh, antiviral, potentially a treatment for COVID-19. So that's got the market buoyant. Uh, we've been seeing European markets trading higher anyway. Your futures were pointing higher. Uh, but this has given a big boost to the market. We saw uh, the UK 100, the FTSE tap 160-100 before just coming off slightly. But the news came out sort of, uh, where are we? That's a four hour chart. Let's bring up a one hour chart, about an hour ago. So you can see it here, just shooting higher off the back of that. So it'd been trading up at 6,000 all day uh, and then shot higher, added 100 points off the back of the Gilead news. But just coming off a little bit um, as the US market opens, um, the DAX broke through 11,000, but has come off a bit as well. Uh, we see it's good for risk, the Gilead news. Uh, we've got gold pulling back to test support at around 1,700, uh, hitting a low there at uh, 1,697 there. Uh, big, big support at 1,691 sort of region here. Uh, that could be tested should risk further improve um, and we see safety uh, 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 move lower. Google's trading 9% higher, uh, well that's Alphabet, sorry, it's trading 9% higher. Um, bring the shares up there, trading at 13.45 there. Um, it's a big gain there for, um, for uh, Alphabet after its numbers were reported uh, last night. So. Um, so far, a good day for risk. We've also had Boeing and GE reporting, but big story today is the Gilead news. And then also we had that GDP print from the US showing first quarter contraction of 4.8%. That was worse than the 4% expected. Um, so the dollar is just a touch softer there. We look at EURUSD, it's just up a bit uh, there off, off the back of that news. Not by much though, and certainly not even testing at uh, yesterday's highs. So um, US GDP contracted sharper than forecast, but it's backward looking data and the bulk of the damage from coronavirus will be done in the second quarter. Um, and then the Gilead news is underpinning market strength. We'll wait to see whether or not that will hold. Uh, so that's it for the moment. We will have more for you uh, as ever here on X-Ray. Thanks for watching.